So there are many menaces to the, to the health of our microbiota. Um, maybe the biggest one is, is the overuse of antibiotics. There are times when antibiotics are very necessary, but in general, the whole world thinks that they're for free and they actually have a lot of biological cost. So if, if somebody is very sick, they need the antibiotic, but if not, uh, they can do, uh, they should not have an antibiotic because of the cost. And then there are antibacterial substances in our food. We're using antibacterial soaps all the time. Babies are born by cesarean section. They're missing their initial inoculation with their mother's bacteria. So these are, these are some of the kinds of things that are, are, are going on that don't allow babies, children, to form the, the correct microbiota. Let's say we have an infection on our skin and we need an antibiotic. We take that antibiotic through our mouth. That antibiotic eventually goes into our bloodstream and it travels all over our body. Some of it will go here, but it will, it will go everywhere, including in our gut. And, and that antibiotic will kill or suppress many bacteria. Even bacteria that are not the target, but just bacteria that are present in our gut, on our skin, in women in their vagina, in their mouth, all the same. In the United States, in order to take an antibiotic, you have to be prescribed an antibiotic by a doctor. And it becomes a medical judgment when an antibiotic is necessary. Actually, we know that there's a lot of variation. Some doctors prescribe antibiotics all the time. Some prescribe very little. For me, as a uh, medical professional, uh, I'm trying to get uh, doctors to use it, antibiotics more regularly and less, less often. In the United States, it's been estimated that 70 or 80 percent of the antibiotics used in childhood are excessive or wrong. And there's recent data comparing with Sweden indicating at least, at least 60 percent are, are misused. And it, here in Europe, uh, if you look at the variation in antibiotic use by country, in, in some measures there's a three-fold variation between countries.